everybody. Woo! Every time I wake up, I see some on YouTube via and tweets. I'm tired. I'm coming to you as a mother point of view. Number one, when y'all announced y'all were getting married, I knew it was a big mistake. Big mistake. Y'all was going down the wrong water road. Because I pick up as a, I'm going to get on Tweezy too. Via, you're controlling. The stuff that Tweezy said was true. Some of the stuff you said was true. And some of the stuff you said via, you dragged it to the max. And it didn't sound right. One thing about me, you be talking to children. And children going to believe everything that comes out your mouth. But adult is going to. I'm driving there. Adult is gonna look and see, and because what I don't like, you block out what you say, but you put up there what other people say, what Tweezy say, and what his ex-wife texts you. You blocked off what you say. I seen it, and I picked that up. I don't like that. Don't block it out. Say what you say. If you're gonna put it out there, put what you say. Just like that little clip video that you put out there. I heard you cussing and everything, but you cut some of it off. Some of it off, what you were saying. You want a reaction from Tweezy, so you could put it on um, YouTube and say, "See, I told you he was abusive. I told you, but see, it didn't work in your favor. You got abusive. You are controlling. You got mad because Tweezy wouldn't do what you want him to do." He wouldn't stay. He didn't do like you told him to do. So you thought you had a house man, but it, you, it wasn't it. You figured he didn't have no TV. You want to mold him and make him, but it didn't work out that way. If you done, you done. Stop going on YouTube. I had a problem with you going on YouTube telling all your business. That was not right. I thought you were so wrong. I put your business out there. Then you're going to bring other people in your mess. You're going to talk about his grandma on uh, uh, DDG Kennedy. That has nothing to do with it. You want to bring everybody in. you trying to. You're doing a smash campaign. Let it go. Leave it alone. What you're doing is via is messing yourself up in court. You already admit of being a bruiser to tweeze. You already said he didn't hit you. You already said you smacked him twice in the face. I don't care what nobody say. You don't put your hands on nobody. And a man don't put his hands on a woman and a woman don't put her hands on a man. That was abuse. That was abuse. And I'm telling you that now. Once he gave you the STD, you made that decision to stay. If somebody gave me an STD, Bye-bye. See you later. I wouldn't have married. I wouldn't have had no baby by. I wouldn't do anything. If you forgave him, you should have left it in the past. You bringing everything up in the past. Go get some help by him. You just had a baby and it's overwhelming. And, and you got your other daughter is overwhelming. Go get some help. Everybody get help. I have a therapist. Everybody needs someone to talk to. You don't go on YouTube and talk to your little chin. Because kids don't know. They ain't never had no baby. They ain't never had no husband. So how are they going to give you some advice? You keep on letting this web, these YouTube kids, boost you up and hype you up to do some stupid stuff. Talking about some receipt. Grow up, girl. Grow up. Get your life together. And stay off YouTube. I don't want to see you up here again. Putting crazy shit up here. Tweezy. You got mad too fast. Yes, you have an anger problem. And I've been seen in that. But I told my best friend, when you announced y'all was getting married, I said, it ain't going to work. She controlling. She want him to do what she want to do. She going to give him a lot of automated. And that's what happened. I don't want to get the comment say, no, wrong road. You should have took my advice when I told you wrong road. As that dog, I don't know what happened to the dog. I don't know if you dropped the dog, somebody dropped the dog. But that text message between her and her best friend ain't show shit. It just showed that we don't know what she was talking about. I ain't heard no dog. If somebody would have said, is he feel bad about dropping the dog? Did he feel bad about throwing the dog? I was like, okay, you threw that dog, you wrong. I don't know. 
Because I don't know what they was talking about. They can be talking about how he talked to her. Did he feel bad how he talked to her or whatever. I don't know what happened or what what it is. You put that out there because you want everybody to get it be against him. You stupid. Because you cutting off your own meal ticket. You got to take care of that baby. He had to take care of that baby. So how he going to take care of your baby if he ain't doing YouTube anymore? He done lost his subscriber. See, stop being stupid. That's what I'm talking about. Stop being stupid. What it is, you won't tweeze it back. I'm telling you now, he ain't going to go back to you because one thing about a man, you kick too low. Y'all need to go your own way. I'm not no therapist. I'm not no psychiatrist, so go get you one. I'm not no doctor, so go find you one. Because this is a mess, a big mess. It don't make no sense. And y'all dragging his sister in it. She ain't got nothing to do with it. She told y'all and sit down and talk to y'all and told y'all that y'all need to see somebody. Y'all choose not to go see nobody, so that's on y'all. She told you need to find some kind of way to co-parent. Get 50-50 custody. You have her, you have have the baby for six months. He had the baby other six months. That's only fair. You trying to be the devil. I see right through you, Violet. I seen right through you a long time ago. When Tweezer did a video, I think he cut his hair or something. You told him not to cut your... You said, you didn't ask me, can you cut your hair? I'm your wife. Oh, I got good memory. I said, she controlling. And he said, babe, you can't tell me what to do with my body, and that's your problem. You control. You want somebody... You don't want no husband. You want a lap dog. You want somebody you can boss around, tell what to do, and move when you want them to move. It don't work like that. It do not work like that. Y'all need to get together. I'm disappointed in you, Vaya, and I'm disappointed in you, Tweezy. Like I said, half of the stuff Vaya says is true. Half of the stuff it says Tweezy is true. I don't know. I wasn't even there. None of y'all was in their house. Can't nobody tell me they seen him do anything. I knew Tweezy was unhappy a long time ago because I told my best friend, I said, I stopped watching watching their um, video because it was sad looking at it because you could tell Tweezers was very unhappy. If you were sleep by you, why couldn't he go to the studio? Let him go. I would have said go. Bye bye. You better not come up here when the sun you better not come home when the sun come up. That's what I would say. You can't control a man. When you gave Tweezer the ultimatum, he's an alpha man. And he's like, okay, I'm going to prove it to you. I'm going to do what I want to do. So he did it. Tweezer, your mama knew. That's why she did that video and asked y'all those questions. And advice said, oh, we meant to be each other. We know each other. We love each other. You didn't know nothing about each other. Bob, you had a chance to go back home. But you want to get married and you feel you can stay if you got married. I believe you got pregnant for Mina because there's so much stuff out here to trap Tweezy. It didn't work out the way you wanted it to work out. Now you're trying to hold that baby over his head so he can do what you want him to do. It ain't like that. You digging a hole for yourself when you do all these videos. Stop doing the videos. Please stop. Stop doing the video. Ask yourself why Tweezer has not responded to all your videos. Ask yourself. Because if he responds to your video, those videos could be used in court. That's why he respond. Smart man. You wanted him to get his teeth done. Yes, you did. You had a problem with it because when he did a video, you kept on telling him when he went to France the first time, you kept on telling him to put his teeth in. He said, well, I don't want to put them in. You said, put the teeth in so they can see how you look. We already seen how he looked in his teeth. You wanted him to put his teeth in. That's the problem. I believe he paid most of the money and you helped him pay. He did the same thing for you because I remember when he bought your first camera. So it's just like... You said I did all this. Y'all help each other out. It don't make no difference how much somebody did, how much we did. We help each other out. And that's what kills me with couples when they get mad. They say, I did this for her. I did this for him. You're equal. Y'all help each other out. Keep on listening to these little chairs. Keep on. 
all these YouTube keep on listening to these little children, and that's what break their relationship. Y'all let little kids. Y'all need to be in school. I'm so glad they make no kid go back to school. It don't make no sense. Y'all so busy on YouTube and somebody else's marriage and somebody else's business. Children need to stay in children's places and stay out grown folks' business. And that's what makes me mad. And y'all sitting up here talking to these little chairs, worrying about what these little chairs saying. You too, Tweezy. Y'all worrying about these little chairs saying, answering these little chairs. Vibe, you talking to the little kids at 3 o'clock in the morning. They should be in the bed. That sound crazy. And that's what I'm talking about. Crazy. Nobody thinking about these babies. Nobody thinking about the babies. Everybody out for themselves. Tweezy and Vaya. Think about these babies. Vaya, you need to find some help for real. And you got to realize no man in on this universe going to do what you tell them to do. Unless you get a yes man. Unless you get a, a real, real nerdy, nerdy, nerdy man. A desperate man. Nobody's going to do what you tell them to do. You can't. That because you married, you can't. Oh, you don't own your husband. You can't tell your husband, don't do this. If you do this, don't you come back no more. You don't do stuff like that. You have to sit down and talk about things. If he, you told him to go to be, go do movie. I mean, not movie, sorry. Go do um, music. If you, if you do your research, people who do music stay in, stay in the studio all night. That's when they start. That's when they start doing the, um, they do what they need to do for their family in the morning. And at nighttime, they go to the studio and get their record and stuff together. You knew this. You knew what you were getting yourself into. Once he gave you the Z, why don't you just walk away? And say, look, we could be friends, but you gave me something. And I think that was wrong. And I asked you. And you crazy too. Why would you let somebody have sex with you raw and you just met them? Girl, bye. And Tweezy, if you know you gave somebody something, why would you have sex raw with a woman? Boy, please. You knew someone will right. You should have said, look, just to be safe, let's lose, use protection because we just meeting. And if she said, well, I got tests and I'm clean, we still need to be protection. That's all you had to say. Buys too much protection out here for you to get pregnant. Y'all wouldn't even be married a good two weeks before you got pregnant. It's just sad. It's just a big mess. So y'all, both of y'all stay off internet. Stay off YouTube. Just stay off of it. If you ain't gonna do your regular show, stay off of it. The next video, Vi, you gonna do Tweezy left me with two babies and I'm doing it by myself. You know why? You asked for it. You put this man out in another country that was dirty and low down. He had no family there, had no friends there, but you put him out soon he get back. You dirty by him. That's nasty. And I don't care what nobody else say, I wouldn't do a dog like that and put him out in another country that he don't have no family, anything. You got four bedrooms. Tweezer could have went in one no bedroom and continue helping you with the babies, but you're going to put him out because you're nasty like that. People looking over that. Because he wants to go to a studio to enhance his career. But you're going to put him out. you dirty volume. Tweezy, y'all get it together. Y'all need to go in for joint custody. Six months here, six months there, and cut it clean. And you need to come back to the United States, Tweezy, and get your shit together. And Vaya, <laughs> go see a doctor, both of y'all. Y'all need a therapist to talk to. And Tweezy, you need to deal with your anger management. Because some things is true value saying, and some things is far, far-fetched. <laughs> that she was saying. And as always, y'all have a blessed and wonderful day. I'm praying for you, Vaya. I'm praying for you, Tweezy. And I'm praying for those babies. Mwah.